By now, you should know that the most popular search engines such as Google, Bing, and Yahoo track your information. Over time, they collect data on your personal interests, browsing behaviors, IP address, and sometimes even your personal info. This is done to give users a more personal experience by having search results and advertisements tailored to them. Obviously, there are a bunch of security and privacy concerns that come with it. One common solution to this problem is using one of the many private search engines on the internet. Not only will they keep you anonymous, they also give you unbiased search results. DuckDuckGo is currently one of the best options available due to its many convenient features. Let's quickly talk about what it is, and what it is to offer. DuckDuckGo is a search engine that vows to never collect or share your personal information. They have an entire privacy policy on their website that you may read through. The main gist of it is that using DuckDuckGo will keep you somewhat anonymous. Plus, it prevents other sites from knowing what you've been searching for. Their policy does state that your searches are saved, though not in a way that can be traced back to you. This is because they don't keep your IP address and other unique identifiers. The saved searches are supposedly done to fix minor problems such as misspellings. Its user interface is very similar to Google. After typing in a keyword, you may filter your results to show only images, videos, news, and even meanings. You can also easily boost results for a certain country if you need to find locally relevant information. To provide a smoother experience, DuckDuckGo allows you to continue scrolling through search results instead of tediously going through several pages to find what you need. You'll also notice that there isn't much visual clutter, and that ads are both rare and very unobtrusive. One of the best things about DuckDuckGo is the amount of customization options you have at your disposal. To access the settings, click on the button on the upper right corner and then go to other settings. From here, you can change several things such as how your search results are presented, the interface language, the overall UI theme, font size, and even your privacy settings. You don't really have to change anything under privacy though, unless you absolutely know what you're doing. There's also a list of syntaxes that can help narrow down your queries, but the most unique feature of this search engine has to be the syntax known as Bang. Bangs allow DuckDuckGo users to directly search through supported websites. There are tons of sites that support this feature, and using it is very simple. To use Bangs, all you have to do is type an exclamation mark and a few recommendations will pop up. It even has an autocomplete system that lists down the possible choices. As an example, if you type the letter A, websites such as Amazon and AliExpress will show up. After typing your desired bang, put in a keyword or phrase that you'd like to search for in the specified website. For example, typing exclamation mark YouTube movie trailers will immediately send you over to YouTube search results for movie trailers. Over the years, DuckDuckGo has grown from being a one-man project to being a small international company. With that said, they actually do not take donations because they make enough money from their growing traffic. Instead, they encourage potential donors to support other privacy-related services and causes. There are also a lot of contributors from the open source community that help with things such as translations, instant answers, and coding in general. This is led by a group of community leaders who act as either developers or active moderators on Duck.co and Reddit. Currently, the subreddit serves as a place for users to ask questions regarding the service or to report bugs they've encountered with any of its features. DuckDuckGo is compatible with most browsers and is available as an extension for both Firefox and Google Chrome. Installing the add-on will automatically change your default search engine. It will also give you a handy toolbar button that can be easily toggled on and off. It also has its own official app for both iOS and Android called DuckDuckGo Search and Stories. So, should you use DuckDuckGo? If you value your online privacy, then this search engine is definitely a viable option. Even without that in mind, all of its extra features make it a worthy competitor to Google. With its growing team, it's bound to get even better in the following years. At the end of the day though, most of it boils down to personal preference. Try it out and see if it suits your needs.